Hi everyone, welcome back. So in today's video, I am going to share all of the products that I've used up. I am so excited to do this product empties video after so long. Everything that I've used up has been collecting in this basket. So I am going to dig in and share everything with you guys. You guys are going to know what I thought of the products, if I'm going to repurchase them and everything else. So the first thing is this dry shampoo. I'm just going to pick up things in random order. And this is the floral and flirty blush one. I loved using this. I absolutely love dry shampoo. I'm obsessed with them. And I go through cans very quickly because I use them very regularly. This one's completely out. There's nothing in it. Um, really like using this. Would highly recommend and would definitely repurchase. Next, I have this Chico Soft Cleansing Wipe. This is actually a baby wipe and it's alcohol free. I love using this for everything, cleaning my face, makeup, you know, just cleaning the edges of my makeup. If I have to clean my tables at times, I just use it to clean makeup, like just the product in itself. I sometimes use it to clean my shoes. I just use this for everything and anything and I somehow misplaced the um, flap that covers it so it got dry. There are a couple of them left but it's completely over and this is something that again I would definitely repurchase and I think I remember recommending this to you guys because I was obsessed with this. Next I have this micellar water from Aven. This is for sensitive skin. Um, honestly I didn't really like this as much and that's why even though a little bit of it is left I'm not using it anymore. Um, I think I remember this stinging my eyes and it isn't that effective in um, removing makeup that quickly. I prefer other micellar waters that work much better than this like Bioderma and um, yeah this is I don't know if it's like outstanding or out of this world. I basically finished this while doing lip swatches which is when I used to use this then I used to not feel as bad because you need a lot of cleansers when you're like doing lipstick swatches and then I used to just use this for that but it was kind of okay I don't think this is the best and I don't think so I'm repurchasing this oh this is one of my favorite things uh, this is from forest essential this is their body polisher and this is the cane sugar and tamarind one oh my god guys Ugh, the body polishers from forest essentials are the best like they are the bomb.com honestly uh, so this one comes um, with sugar it's like a sugar scrub uh, which is like immersed in oil it's a little bit of the oil left but the scrub is completely over and I enjoyed this till the last scoop uh, the best when it comes to um, scrubbing your legs after shaving or just using this every other day it really helps in getting rid, rid of any dry flakiness any um, tan that you have it really helps in detanning your skin and it just keeps a very hydrated very soft very moist smells heavenly you can basically just pick up any of the body polishers and they are all fabulous depending on what kind of fragrance that you like um, all of them are really high quality your skin feels really nice and soft after you use this so yeah this I would 100% repurchase and would 100% recommend I love this next I have have this cleansing shower butter uh, this is in Nargis I love the Nargis the entire Nargis fragrance range from forest essential and this is something which is like a butter uh, but you use it um, with loofah and it just all lathers up so it's very very hydrating great for the colder months when your skin tends to get drier than usual I really loved using this to shave um, I would definitely get the shower butter again but I think I would try some other fragrance because I have used up all of like the things that are there in the Nargis range so I want to try something else next I have this body lotion from uh, Palmer's cocoa butter this is the massage lotion for stretch marks um, it's a great thick body lotion that see seeps in <laughs> I can't find my words uh, so it just seeps into your skin very easily it's very light despite being very hydrating so this is great for summer months I have a lot of stretch marks on my boobs and my ass a little bit on my thighs so I used to use this very regularly you can mix a little bit of bio oil in it and then apply it before you go to sleep I think it really helps in um, lightening the 
stretch marks it does not really help in getting rid of them completely but it does really help in preventing any stretch marks from happening say if you have been working out a lot or if you tend to uh, lose and gain weight very fast which I do um, so this is something that is really nice I would definitely recommend this or the one that comes in the tub which is like the pure cocoa butter but that's like for the colder month that's really really thick oh that's amazing as well but this one is great for everyday use uh, it comes in this uh, bottle which is really easy to use so you just pump and it's on your hand and you just massage this wherever you want again something that I would definitely recommend next I have uh, this pore cleansing face wash from Plum uh, this is from their green tea range I think I remember doing a review for them I really liked it it's quite foaming um, it's very cleansing I went through it pretty quickly um, used this when I was traveling it's like very nice for everybody who has oily skin and acne prone skin I actually really like the toner uh, the most from the green tea range next I have the Kiehl's ultra facial cleanser I already repurchased this I have another one already which is in my shower I <laughs> this is so good you have no idea I literally scraped every inch of face wash that was inside this it is so good um, really helps in getting rid of all of your makeup all of the impurities all of the dirt and it's great for all skin types so if you have dry skin combination skin oily skin this is going to be so good I really like this even though this is expensive it's a very very good cleanser try it I actually have a Dove Intense Repair Shampoo in here but I don't think so I used it my brother used it and I've forbidden everyone from throwing stuff that's over in the bathroom which is why it ended up here I might have tried this a couple of times but uh, Dove is really nice like I'm sure a lot of you guys have tried Dove shampoo it just makes your hair feel very very soft every time I use Dove it just makes my hair feel very very silky and soft that's the only thing I associate myself whenever I'm using like Dove shampoo but this is not something I use I'm not gonna lie and say oh I use this and all but this is what my brother uses <laughs> it's so cute that he actually dumped it here um, yeah there's Dove shampoo in it next I have Ifaklar duo you guys already know my love for this and I'm so sad that it's not available anymore <laughs> why why you do this to me <laughs> um, they have um, I think officially removed La Roche-Posay from India along with Vichy and so they're not officially available anymore Ugh, I'm so sad I love love this I use this like right after I've applied toner before any moisturizer that I'm using I love this so much I also have their um, sunscreen this is the La Roche-Posay and Thelios XL 50 plus I think I got this last year um, use this a lot it's matte it's a little heavy but excellent for sun protection um, it's very very potent very efficient um, it does not really have a very shiny finish it does have a little bit of white cast though I have this shampoo from L'Oreal this is the L'Oreal professional vitamino color AOX I have used this a lot actually I also have the uh, conditioner I can't see it I'm sure I must have thrown it away uh, but really liked it it's quite nice it uh, really leaves this shine on your hair um, it's good to uh, use this if you have like if you have colored your hair uh, because it does not really strip the color away from your hair and I I'm actually not repurchasing this at the moment because I'm using the Innova color one um, I forgot what it's called um, it's the it's the one with argan oil and tea tree in it it's this black packaging so that's the one that I got um, but this is something which is a very affordable range and you can use this if you have colored hair then I have a bottle of Bioderma this is the Sensi Bio H2O a great product this is a cult product amazing to remove makeup with I think it does not really remove waterproof mascara that well except for that it removes everything brilliantly really like this to like take a little bit of q-tip and use this to clean my wing liner or you know clean my lips like my lipstick if I'm wearing like something bright and stark or just use this to clean my face even if I'm not wearing any makeup just to take this a little bit on a cotton pad and then just to remove any dirt or excess oil 
on my face. Like it's really nice. It's it suits all skin type. A little expensive, but it's very nice. I have a Ifaklar face wash. Uh, this is the travel size one, so I've used this while I was traveling, and I really really like this. It's very foaming very very cleansing um, it's for oily and sensitive skin and for anybody who has acne prone skin you know my love for Ifakla range like I don't want to say the same thing over and over again there has to be Ifakla in my empties video like I really love these things I already have repurchased this like not repurchased like when I bought it I got like two three I always buy them in bulk and now you can't even buy them next I have this from Iraya this is the almond nutrifying skin food I love this so much. I remember like just raving on and on and on about this. It just worked so well for my skin. I was using this before I got obsessed with the Chia Seed Cream from the face shop. I would definitely 100%, 200% recommend this. Um, oh, it just smells so satisfying. Like, you know, it's got this really nice scent to it. This was very nourishing, very moisturizing, a little heavy, but it worked very well on my skin despite my skin being very oily. It sat very nicely. So I use this during the colder months, but um, if you have dry skin, you can use this even now. I love this. It's so affordable. It's organic and really nice. You guys could give this a go. Next, I have this from OGX. This is the Ever Straight Brazilian Keratin Therapy Conditioner. Oh my god, this conditioner is amazing. If you have curly, frizzy, unruly hair, this would work so well for your hair. The only thing I don't like about this is that the packaging gets a little annoying once the product starts to like reach about here, once it starts to get over, like it's very difficult to squeeze it out. So as you can tell, there's like this dent on it, but the product is so good. It's very, very, very nourishing. It is the best for dry, damaged hair and for anybody with like really curly hair. Try this, it's it's very nice. I really like this. I would definitely repurchase this. I already have something from OGX from their Argan Oil range, actually. I keep trying their stuff. I really like OGX hair products. I have this Nivea uh, deodorant. This is the whitening even toned underarms uh, deodorant. I already repurchased the roll-on from the same range. So this is really nice. I remember doing a full video on it. Um, it's very light, it's free from alcohol and that's, I always make sure that it's alcohol free whenever I put stuff in my underarms and this really is nice, it's very um, moisturizing on your underarm actually, not too dehydrating, um, also you can use this to prevent your underarms from going dark in the long run. I only have two more things left. Uh, the first thing is this one from Nykaa. This is their dual toned nail animal remover. It's fast acting and acetone free. Works really well. The only thing is that the packaging is glass. So you have to be a little careful. And lastly, I have this body mist from First Essential. This is from the Nergis range. I really like the smell of this, but I wouldn't repurchase this because I am like I, I have so many stuff from Nargis that I want to try something else but the body mist is really nice but it does not really last that long uh, so you can use this to freshen yourself up you can keep this in your bag and uh, spray it on throughout the day uh, yeah but I wouldn't like get the Nargis one I would try something else so that's everything in my basket Ugh, it's all dirty and sticky um, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video I thought for this month's Nykaa sale recommendation I would show stuff that I've actually used and things that I've completely used up and give you like my opinion on them so that you know if in case something fancies you you can get them while it's on sale um, so the links to all of the products are in the info box down below so you can click on the links and just check out the products for yourself and that's it for this video thank you so much for watching please subscribe if you guys haven't already and I'll see you very soon in my next video bye